Hey guys, a couple of you asked for a video about uh, numbness in your knee post ACL surgery or total knee replacement. So I'm gonna go through really quickly and just break down by drawing on my own knee exactly what happens after surgery and why you might get numbness in the area that you do around the knee. So I'm just gonna get myself set up. So this is my knee right here. Now I've pre-drawn on myself but I'm gonna tell you guys exactly where the nerves go and why you might get a little bit of numbness in the front of your knee. So we've got a big nerve that runs along the inside of our leg called our saphenous nerve. This nerve comes down like this and it goes on the inside of our leg and it keeps running down this way. Now there's a branch of the saphenous called, uh, sorry, there's a branch of the saphenous called the inferior branch of the saphenous nerve which breaks off like this and keep in mind everyone's body is a little bit different but it sort of takes this part here. Now I'm going to go through the two surgeries to explain why you might get numbness in certain areas. When ACL surgery happens there's two uh, incision sites depending on if it's a hamstring or a quadriceps graft. The hamstring graft surgery incision site is right there and then they'll make some extra ports here and here. So you can see that incision site cuts the inferior branch of the cutaneous nerve. Now, surgeons will try to avoid nerves when possible, but sometimes they will hit a nerve that they can't see. And unfortunately, this is a common one that they can uh, hit. Now for um, patella ACL grafts, the incision site is somewhere along here, right in the midline and also for knee replacements, in Australia anyway, the surgeons will cut right through the knee like this. And you can see that nerve is running right along the path of all of these incision sites really. Now it doesn't mean everyone gets numb, but there is a big chance that you might get numb after surgery. Now usually if you hit the inferior branch, you'll notice an area of numbness somewhere around this area here. Now it's very common post-surgically, so I'll just colour that in. Very common to get numbness through this area. Nothing to be worried about at all. Um, that, that area there is, is very normal. You can, if somehow the saphenous nerve, nerve gets damaged, that is when you can have increased numbness, which comes down your leg in that sort of a pattern there. Should be all on the inside of your leg. Now, if you read further on the blog that I've, I've written around numbness on the knee, um, often it's a waiting game to see whether this comes back. So if the nerve has been purely sliced, the two nerve ends will try to find each other to, um, and, and if they do, then the sensation may return. But the rule of thumb is give it a year and what sensation you have is what you're left with. The good news is that if there's a little bit of numbness around the knee, it's not gonna harm your progress moving forward. So it's nothing really to worry about. But um, I, I was getting a lot of questions, so I thought that I would fix that up for you guys. So uh, thank you for watching, and if you have any more questions, please read the blog, reach out to me at clickphysiotherapy.com, and we'd love to help you however we can. Have an awesome day, guys.